Hello, Tackle Tacticians. On today's episode, we're going to cover powder coating your spinnerbait heads, buzzbaits, and jigs in a little modification, I should say, maybe, to help your day and your powder coating process a little easier. Uh, a lot of us, we all use this little small little toaster ovens. You can pick them up at $5, $10 at a yard sale or um, Goodwill, what have you. Uh, we also do large scale ovens also. But on this little case, we're just going to show you a quick little how-to that we kind of found that it's a little easier to, to deal with. Uh, the biggest problem is with those is when you're carrying your jigs or your lures and you put them on your rack and you get them all lined up, you got them powder coated and you go to slide the whole thing in to do a fairly large production run. Well, they slide and they'll hit each other, they knock the paint off of them, what have you, before you can actually coat them. Or even after, if you're in a hurry, you pull them out and they're still hot, they stick together. Well, over the years, we found a little easier way. We actually use a little piece of all thread. We used to go to a local hardware store, your home improvement center. And of course the all thread really helps out with the lures from spinning or sliding back and forth and touching each other. So that's a little tip, a uh, trick. You can actually just cut them or have them cut to size. You can put them individually if you like. Um, we go the little extra mile. We actually weld them together. We cut our pieces together and we make us a little sliding tray. So we can actually take this tray in and out, close her up, and there you go. And you don't have to worry about them slipping and sliding and touching each other as often and causing the mess. Hey, we hope you like this edition of a how-to. Please stay tuned. We've got more videos coming. We appreciate it. And remember, take a kid fishing. 